And that was like one of the main problems that I had with the Obama administration. You know, people sort of let him slide on that. But Obama yeah. was one of the worst with whistleblowers ever. There was a part of the Hope and Change website, a part of the Hope and Change website that was later redacted or uh, uh, deleted was that they were talking about expanding protection for whistleblowers who are exposing someone breaking the law, which is exactly what Edward Snowden did. Yeah, that like like Obama tricked me. He tricked a lot he of people. He tricked me, man. I voted he might have for tricked him. himself. Dude, I was like, this is going to unite the races of America, and he's going to be transparent. And he's such a good speaker. He's made me cry, like literally with hope. And then I see what, the, what, he's, what he does, and I'm like, dude, I, you know 77 cents is bullshit, man. And it's like those little things where I'm we'll like. We'll say what that is. Oh, the, the, uh, they say the wage gap between men and women is 77 cents on the dollar. And then he said that publicly. He said speech. it publicly, right. And it's one thing if it's BuzzFeed. It's the president of the United States. And that is completely bullshit. It's been debunked by the female president of Harvard. Like, this is not reality at all. It's like, and so when I see that. explain what it really is, though. Okay, it really is more like uh, four cents, maybe. It's a. Uh, uh, they, they don't include uh, factors such as quitting for having a children or dangerous jobs or all this shit. That's just the rough average. But if you look at this, a man and a woman with the same job for the same amount of years with the same education, it's basically the same. 